The 17 year old was here with friends enjoying a summer afternoon along the river, jumping from this former railroad trestle into the water. First responders say he climbed up to the very top, leapt off into the water and did not resurface. That's when his friends became very concerned and they called 911 around 440 this afternoon. It took swift water rescue teams nearly an hour to find him. We're told medics rushed the teen to Overlake Hospital. He was underwater for a long time, about 45 to 50 minutes. The city of Snoqualmie says people who swim or paddle in the river need to be very careful right now because although that water looks enticing, it can be very dangerous. We get kids from all over the region coming to our beautiful river. Unfortunately, right now it is very, very deep. And so it did take a while to come to uh, find him. Uh, we also con are concerned about people that inner tube on this river because it's very cold still. Um, it looks like a beautiful day, but it's very cold and you can easily get hypothermia very quickly. The trail over the river has reopened tonight and there's a sign up there saying no jumping. In Snoqualmie, Ted Land, King 5 News.